Hey guys, what's up? Star is not going to be here for this video because this video portrays to me personally. And you guys can see my laptop, but there's nothing really on here. I'll just go to you. I'll just go to my YouTube. Alright. So. Welcome back to M2L. Today, um, it's another versus episode is apparently the... Okay, this is not centered. Sorry about this. Right there. Alright. Whatever. Well, I look like I was the center, but I am. Alright. So, today is another versus, and if you guys know, I do a lot of versus, like, um... When Star was here, I was going to be doing, um, she was supposed to be doing, um, Nickelodeon vs. Cartoon Network. And in the video that she did, um, they are in a playlist called Star of the Heat, but the first one she did when she was here, um, she, um, decided not to do what I had planned, and she decided to tell her a little bit about herself because she was here and it's her first time. So, as I said, well, as she said, that she would be taking over this channel, sometimes, not all the time, like, if it's a, if it's a thing that really doesn't portray to me, like, me personally, Star will be here, so... Yeah. So, yeah. So today I'm doing another Versus episode, and today we are going to be doing... We are going to be versing two very, very, very cute boys against each other, and they are both pop stars. So, let's see. Today we're doing Justin Bieber versus Austin Mahone. Now, yes, I have both. I have both these books. And if you guys, tomorrow... I mean, yeah, tomorrow, Wednesday, you guys will actually be seeing this book in my video for Cody. Because he did Justin, um, he did a Justin Bieber video. So, yeah. So, Justin Bieber versus Austin Mahomes. Now, personally, I can't decide which one I like better. And there's a sticker on here that I need to get off. Literally, I love both of these people, and if you guys know, if you guys watch my GSA channel, you guys will know that actually, I'm, I'm reading Back to the Summer, Justin Bieber, and Austin Mahone, which, huh, God. So, yeah, um, go on record, both of these people are actually not gay, they are both straight, in that story they're gay, and in one of my stories, I portray Austin to be gay. I don't know if I ever did a Justin Bieber story. Oh, yeah, no. Did I ever do a Justin story? I don't think I did a Justin story, but whatever. Justin Bieber and Austin Mahone are both straight, and I don't know if Justin, Be Justin is dating anyone, but I did hear, I believe last year, um, Austin Mahone is dating Becky G. But whatever. So, first we're going to talk about Justin. Justin Bieber is, let me, hold on, I'm like not prepared, um, I'm actually going to go on Google and look up some stuff, so how old, alright, Justin Bieber at the time of this recording is, Mar um, his birthday is March 24th, 1994, so he is 21 years old, so, yeah, and then I believe Austin Mahone is seven. He's either seventeen or eighteen now. Austin Mahone is nineteen years old, and he's dating Becky G. And Becky G. is eighteen. Huh? Huh? I could date Austin because he's one year above my age range. Justin, I can't date. So. Justin is 21, Austin is 19. He was born a year before me, so on April 4th. So, let's talk about Justin first. Justin Bieber has been through so goddamn much in the past. Before, when he was 16, he was a cute, childish, young, loving, loving boy. Then, when he started getting older, he went into this whole Ryan Minaj phase. I think about two years ago, he dyed his hair blonde, and, he's, and there was a picture on Instagram that says, Do I look like Ryan Minaj? I like that picture, and I said, No, but in my mind, I'm like, Bitch, no, you are not gonna ever look like Ryan Minaj. It's because you have blonde hair, it does not mean that you look like Ryan Minaj. No one can top his style. I just want a big tangent there, but I had good reason, because no one can top Ryan. 
no one in the whole entire world can top Ryan Menasha's style. I love Ryan Menasha's style. Wait a minute. I just remember something. Ryan Minaj and Justin Bieber are both the same age. Wow. Okay. I just made that connection now. But yeah. So, Justin Bieber has been through a lot of faults, and I think Justin should take a break. Like, take a break and, like, calm down. Have a whole week to himself. Just can't leave the house. Just. Stay on the couch, watch some TV, watch something other than himself. And then come back and maybe make some music. But I know he's on tour right now, and one of my friends, um, Kenzie, who goes to my church, she is going to a Justin Bieber concert, and I literally begged her to take me with her, and sadly, I cannot go. Well, you guys might be wondering, well, why do you want to go to, to see Justin Bieber so bad if you hate him? Number one, I do and hate him. I am literally in love. Well, I'm not madly in love. Like, I was not madly in love with him when he was a young kid. Because back then I hated him. And I thought, oh, it's just a stupid another boy who's literally going to fade away. No one's ever going to hear about him in like two years. Suddenly that went up. He was known everywhere. Now, why am I still talking about Justin? And why am I asking? And why I just put this necklace on? This necklace is blue and purple. My boyfriend, my boyfriend Max, he loves blue and purple, and he loves What Do You Mean by Justin Bieber. So, we kind of gauge that song. I never liked it, but then after he told me it's my, it hit this favorite song, okay, I'm like, in my head, okay, I have to listen to the song so I can be with this person. So, on Friday, um, I do two things. One, I gave, um, I, well, I did one thing that day. I literally got the money that I need, walked all the way down to where I get all my makeup, and I bought a $50, $50 iTunes gift card, and the first song I bought was What Do You Mean by Justin. It was in my wish list, so, yeah. So, yeah. I got that song, and while we were texting one night, I was listening to it, and then I just typed in What Do You Mean? Just a random topic that um, I just wanted to type in to see what would he say. And then he said, I love that song. It's like, I just got the song from iTunes. He's like, yay! So, yeah. Actually, I have another thing of, of Justin. It's behind the camera. Let me grab it quick. Okay, I've done this. It's still on my desk. I don't know if I'm ever going to do anything with it. I don't think I'll take it apart. Is this Justin Bieber? It's Justin Bieber. Um... Puzzle 100 pieces. I think I'm missing two pieces. It took me a while to put it together because of the face and everything, but yeah. So, Justin Bieber is, um, cute, I'm gonna say. So, oh, oh, that's funny. It's from, I actually got that app from the y YMCA. It's actually from Goodwill. Okay. So, now we're gonna talk about Austin. Um, since I already, since you guys know about Justin, a lot of you probably don't know about Austin, and, I mean, I don't blame you for not knowing about Austin Mahone, but, I mean, Austin Mahone is not that, I mean, he's big now, but back then, when he first came out, no one knew who the fuck he was, and me being one of the people who didn't even know who he was, because I didn't know who Austin Mahone, like, oh, is this another Justin Bieber boy trying to act like him and try to become him, but, I was wrong. Austin Mahone is not like Justin at all. A U S T. Yep. Oh, geez. Austin Mahone. He has a new song called Dirty Work. It is the worst song I've ever heard, so I'm not gonna play that one. I am going to play. I'm gonna volume all the way up. Yeah. All right. Here is one of them. And if you guys watch my GSA channel, you guys will love this one. After a word from our sponsor that I can skip. Tell him what I got him next. You don't need no explanation. Let him see if 
Okay, why I was watching that video most of the time is there is actually going on to the GSA video that um, I shot. If you guys have seen the first episode of the remastered version of a Justin Bieber Awesome Home, the gay story that I mean from there, um, it's hilarious because number one, Austin, um, Alex Canestro, a boy who was dating Austin in that story, is actually a real person and is di and is in Austin's video Banga Banga. So, yeah, his friend is um in the video. You can kind of see him in the background a couple of times. So. Um, if you guys actually want to see who Alex Canestro is, actually go to, um, Google and look up Awesome Home and Alex Canestro. You'll find a picture of what he looks like. Although there is one in picture where they're both in a room and they both have their shirts off. And Austin is literally, I think he's either going like this or like this and they have no shirt on. They have, like, red capes. So, I don't know if that makes it literally just made you uncomfortable or gay guys if you guys are watching. If you guys are gay and you guys like seeing boys shirtless, um, there's your there's your little ticket. But yeah, how far am I? Fourteen minutes. Whoa! All right. Um, that's it. And until next time, I really don't have. So yeah, bye.